it, at some point dawned on me that there was this guy out there who was doing everything he could possibly do to become sort of like a sports celebrity. But he had this secret world where he had like this business that nobody knew about. Nobody knew he was associated with it. It was hidden, a shell company within a shell company within a tribe. And he had somehow managed for years and years and years to get by undetected. There was a woman in Colorado who in late 2004 had taken out over $500 in loans from two payday lenders. And she figured out that they weren't really registered to make loans in Colorado. So she complained to the attorney general. And the attorney general sent a really routine letter to the address on the loan. And the address was this strip mall address in Carson City, Nevada. I enlisted the help of the Nevada attorney general and I said, what are these P.O. boxes? And so we found out that the president officer of both companies was an individual by the name of James Fontana. At the height of our business, uh, we were managers, directors, or officers for about 785 companies. A lot of them we didn't really know because we were contacted by attorneys who did not always give us the exact nature of the business, just that they needed a certain level of protection and anonymity, and so that's what we would provide. 